welcome to Grand Central Madison, the Long Island Railroad's brand new terminal on the east side. And among those cheering the new east side access connection was Governor Kathy Hochul as she took the first train from Jamaica Station to Grand Central Madison. It was quite a journey to get here. I'm not talking about the 22-minute ride from Jamaica Station. I'm literally talking about something that started under eight of my predecessor governors. It's been nine governors who've worked to try and get this accomplished. Connecting the LIRR to the east side of Midtown was first proposed in the 1960s. The project never really gained momentum until the 90s, and the new tunnels were dug from 2007 to 2011. But the MTA fumbled the finish. The price tag kept ballooning from an estimated $4.3 billion in 2011 to a final price tag of more than $11 billion. There was even one final delay in opening the terminal, which the governor promised would happen by the end of last year. The project was a hot mess. We tore it apart, we put it back together again, we said never again are we going to let the schedule slip. MTA Chairman and CEO Jano Lieber says invaluable, albeit pricey, lessons have been learned as the MTA moves forward. It's already modernizing the subway system and continuing to expand up 2nd Avenue, plus renovating Penn Station. And down the line, there's plans to further connect outer neighborhoods of Brooklyn and Queens with an inner borough express train. Contract commitments, accountability, detailed schedule, and a modern design-build approach to mega project construction. And so far, the Building Congress says it's seeing positive signs that the original problems that plagued East Side Access will not spill over into future big plans for the MTA. So I think you're going to see action on all these projects happen quickly. Even Lisa Daglian with the Permanent Citizens Advisory Committee to the MTA was cautiously optimistic. We're at every board meeting and we follow every project. Thank you for riding the Long Island Railroad. What we have seen is that projects are coming in on time, either on budget or under budget.